What's good? Welcome back. My name is Sid, and today I'm going to be trying out the three new events. The crew poo on ice is Forsberg, but frozen. So we got one in street, we got one in hypercar, and one in rally cross. So I thought might as well pick the three best cars of each of the specs, hop in those cars, and then try out uh, each of the... Where even am I? How have I done this? These are some beefy tires, by the way. I made three different builds. Three different builds, if my fingers don't glitch out. I made three different builds with all the different vanities. I think this is like the Nova Pulse stuff with a tinge of electricity, as you can see. Let's hop in this street event. It looks simpler than the hypercar event. We're going to play the hypercar event uh, and the rallycross event. Uh, the rallycross, obviously the Lancer. The hypercar, obviously the Chiron. And this thing, that's a pretty cool intro. The, uh, the Gallardo. God, the reflections. Ooh! Why are the reflections actually good in that intro? Okay. Yes. Okay, after I pass the bridge. What bridge? Where, which, where's the bridge? The Obviously, you got the spikes, you got the, the mosaics and stuff. It's a, it's an interesting gimmick to go with. It's, it's fairly fun. It's fairly fun. And obviously, the snow looking much better than it did before helps. The snow machines and all of that look really cool. Of all the things it could have been... It's definitely interesting to go with an ice style. What's on the sides? Is it just drawings? I don't even know. The color scheme's cooler, I think. As you know, the black and red was fine. It's the red and yellow in the open world of the tracks that I don't like the color scheme of. That is one big ice spike. And also, I'm kind of beaming here. I haven't hit a single wall. I've not spanned out yet. I mean, I am in a meta car, but... Ooh! I don't know if I've actually got parts on, though. I think I might not have... Parts. Oh, that the uh, that's the bridge. Oh, this was the tricky turn. It was not really not the hardest thing ever. And also this lightning uh, smoke. I love it. I what uh, genuinely probably gonna use this a lot. One of my favorite favorite smokes. Like I can put it on the thunder wave. That'll make sense, right? Uh, I can. I, 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 I'm really looking forward to using it. Oh, don't crash into something now. I'm really looking forward to using this thing. The snow looks cool. You know what? All in all, pretty goddamn chic uh, event. But again, oh wait, what did that? What did that say? Okay, I'm gonna have to see that on the next lap. I got three laps, still a bit much, but let's get it done. Oh, there's the sign. Uh, ice and snow don't be slow. <laughs> okay. Oh goddamn it! Reading made me crash. This is this is this this speaks volumes on society. Okay, where's the other sign? Oh, because that one definitely had a lot more. Ice and snow don't be slow. You're not a pumpkin. Don't drive smashed? Are your nerves made of steel? You're going for the win! Oh! D this guy's passionate! Damn! <laughs> the, 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 this, um... Unnamed voice actor is, is a lot more passionate than, uh... Than Forsberg. I mean, hey, Forsberg was cool, though. It's like, hey... Yeah, you handle all that power real well. And it's like, aw... Oh, ah, oh, Forsberg! Forsberg! Let's head over to the Rallycross event, which I know is number three, but we're going to do that first and then do the hypercar event. Here we go. Now, this was the last build I made, so it looks pretty bad, but it's got the the cool topper, the tire topper, and the Aurora Borealis smoke, which looks very, very cool. I must say, Aurora Borealis smoke, and I think this is the nitro for it too. The nitro is kind of okay, but the smoke... Very, very cool. And I, I didn't really know what else to go with. So I put on these interesting tires and then, you know, just a livery and <laughs> color to match, which was the yellow and the blue. Best I could have done. I do like this intro. I like how it's got like a... How do I even describe it? Around the edge. Of, what was that behind me? That is one cool sign. <laughs> uh, but... Um, now there's a downhill bend. Yes. I'll just say that it's a bit technical. Ah, I see. Okay, Rallycross seems to be handling a little better. I mean, I guess this is basically just old Rallycross handling anyway. There we go. What was I going to say before that? Oh, damn it, I forgot. I was talking about something. I don't even remember anymore. The, the sign and then the voice line confused me. God damn it. Okay, well, Aurora Borealis smoke. Oh, this one's got a lot. Okay. Sweet. Where's the rest of... Oh, what, what track is this? Lakeside. This looks like Lakeside. Yeah, it is. Okay. It's got the stalactites and the stalagmites. No way. Pretty pog. Okay, I definitely don't have parts on this thing. I am going so slow. I'm going to be caught up to by the ghost. 
by Tuck. You're not a pumpkin, so don't drop shot. That is what that says. What does that mean? What do What does that mean? Stay cool. No way. <laughs> what does that mean? Oh, I was talking about the intro thing. The intro thing has a bit of blur around the outsides, which is like... I don't know, I feel like that's like the camera being frozen over, right? Like, that's what that- that's what that is, right? I don't- I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> it's again, it's an interesting thing that we've got here. Let's get this one done. This one seems a lot shorter. It feels it, at least. We're already halfway through. One thing about the Aurora Borealis smoke is it's a mouthful, and two, I, I don't know how usable it's gonna be, right? Like, how- how often are we really gonna be able to use the Aurora Bo Blizzard warning? No way. The Aurora Borealis smoke, really. Like, it's cool, but it's one of those gimmicky smokes, so not really part of my usual loadout of vanities anymore. And the final lap, let's just get this one done. Everything looks kind of cool. They're at night. Have all of them been at night? Oh, I've, I've not really been paying attention to that. I hope they're not, because I wouldn't mind some at day. Keep a cool head and step on the gas. Victory can be yours. Now, I, I think it's because I didn't have this thing maxed out. I think it's because I didn't put any parts on this thing, but I, I, I feel like I enjoyed that one the least. I feel like I did. Obviously, we're going to go to the uh, hypercar one now. So, let's go do that. But, I, I yeah, I, I kind of feel like I didn't enjoy that one the most. Oh, it's actually snowing too. Ain't that nice? And here we go. Here's the build I made for hypercar. Yes, a very... Interesting looking sheer on and you know what I was thinking about it and I think this is if it's copyright free It'll be playing right now the uh I'll play some some ice on ice themed music Why not if it's not copyright free then you just uh, like that nothing will be playing right now Well the normal background music will be playing Okay Yes now, I was having a lot of fun in the Glacier Edition with this race, but I don't know how this is going to go in the Sheeran. I've overshot. No. Okay. Now, I don't know how this is going to go. This one loops all the way around. Oh, kind of satisfying. And we're ahead of Sidwaj right now, because obviously I've played this race before. It's kind of fun to balance out the turns. I, I just... I'm really curious to see what the meta strategies for this is going to become. Is Slipstream going to matter? Is, uh, is, is the car even going to be the Chiron? Is the Chiron even going to be the best for this? Or is it going to be some like speedy drifting hypercar? Because it's just drift, but fast, right? Oh, definitely overshot that one. Uh, or I didn't. That works too. Sweet. Okay, please. Please. Oh, that's the second one I just about made. Pretty sick. Pretty fun. This one's a much longer one, which uh, kind of sucks because obviously the three laps. Hey ho. It's a bit a small criticism. It's whatever. No, hit the wall. Oh, so this one's at night too. Was the street one at night? I, d I don't remember. Kind of suck if they're all at night. Eh. Oh well though. Like, oh well. One thing I haven't used this video is the devil horns topper. It's just so goofy. I, I kind of wish I did use it, but I, I just, it's so goofy. Uh, but the other toppers, they're, they're pretty, it's cool. The devil horns is cool. But yeah, I've obviously got the, uh, the ski rack, the everything else. I've got a bunch of other stuff as well. So, you know, it's all right. It, it's all right. And what? Where is this? Is this the monuments, I want to say? I feel like it's monuments. I, d I don't know. I don't really... I don't really think I know the tracks off by heart. I sort of... The tracks pretty much drifted into the... Hey, no pun intended. Into the uh, back of my memory, really, through this season. I'm glad it's, it's, uh, it's the next season now, though. Ooh, ain't that poggers, as they say. Okay. Okay. Let's try and keep it together. Okay, come on. Yeah, I can. Sweet. Those are all the events. Thank you to popular members. A special thank you to famous members. An insane, insane thank you to star member Pro Noob. And an insane, insane, insane thank you to icon members Dustin for the love of life and Eddie Gonzalez. That's about it from me in a...